y'all it is that time of year it is Christmas time holiday time all of the things time cheer and festive so I wanted to talk about my favorite holiday and Christmassy dip powders so they don't have to be Christmas specific but they can be a little some snowflakes up in there you know so I want to talk about all of my holiday and Christmas favorite colors I did a Halloween one recently but now I want to talk about all of the ho 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 festive Christmassy ones so if you're interested in hearing about my favorite holiday and Christmas dip powders, keep on watching. This first set of colors is by Kimber's Creations and it's from her Home for the Holidays trio. The first one is named Home for the Holidays and it is a chunky glitter mixture using all of my current favorite tones for the holiday which are like those deep reds and burgundies, those deep teal greens, and any other mixture that you can include in there. So she put kind of like a nudish kind of color in there. And I love how these all come together into a gorgeous combo and a chunky glitter. Part of this little trio she's got going on, she decided to include a fine glitter that basically matches what I just showed you. So this color is called Traditions and it features the same colors, the burgundy, the pine green, and the nudish kind of color all mixed together. So if you don't like chunky glitter, this is a great option instead of the chunky glitter. And last up in this trio is called Burgundy Bliss. It is the solid part of this trio. It really pulls it all in together. I personally like to work in trios like this with a solid or fine shimmer and then a fine glitter and then a chunky. I really love how this all came together and this burgundy couldn't be any more perfect for this whole trio. So look how these colors really come together. You can even put a green in here and it would look great. Speaking of greens, I'm pulling two colors from CN Designer Dips, Archer and Solitude. These are kind of like burgundy and like the pine green that I was just telling you about and feeling. So if you want to pick up some solids, I think that CN Designer Dips has a really gorgeous opaque colors and these two would be great for Christmas. Keeping on the red and green train, Dear to Dream by APU came out in 2020 and I feel like her and Manny Boss were really ahead of the game on this really red and green train. I mean, yeah, they're your classic Christmas colors, but the way these come together are just so freaking gorgeous. I love it. And then my favorite from her 2021 Christmas collection is Happy Holidays. This literally looks like a Christmas tree, is all meshed up into one glitter. I love all the different textures you have here. You have the lines inside of the stars, you have the circle dots and different sizes, plus the finer glitter in the background. Manny Boss did a red and green in 2020 as well called Mistletoe Kisses. It's mostly like a finer green base. And then you have the reds really coming through in the glitter pieces, plus a little complimentary green. But I really love how these colors came together and they'd go great with those solids that I showed you from CN Designer Dips. Going a little lighter now, this color is called All Groovy Baby and it's from Dipped in Sparkles. It's giving me really retro Christmas vibes. So you still have that prominent red, solid Christmassy red, but now you're pulling in some turquoise colors, which to me is like that staple, the red and turquoise staple for retro Christmas vibes. Furry Flurry is by Bad Kitty Dips, and this came out last year as well. I absolutely love the snowflakes in this and all the different textures. Like, I love it when brands include different styles of glitters together and they actually all work together. It just really looks so fun. So this color is called Red Velvet, and it truly reminds me of the inside of a Red Velvet cake. I love Red Velvet cake, and not only is it just as beautiful here, but it also like swatches so smooth, so opaque, like you really only need two dips, and it's like working with butter. So Revel Nail released an advent calendar in 2020, and this is their day five color. So you got your reds, your greens, and I really don't even know what's going on in the background. Is that pink? Is that purple? I don't know. But I totally thought of Christmas when I saw this color. Revel has a couple hidden gems in their collection, and I think Vendetta is one of them. So it's a fine glitter, not a shimmer, a glitter. It still has texture to it, but I just really love how it's like red-orange fire looking back at me. I feel like this would be a gorgeous color to use in your Christmas manicures this holiday season. 
right, we're throwing this one way back to the very beginning of when I started dipping. Rebel released this in like November of 2017 and it is literally snow. The name could not be more fitting for the dip powder. If you open your jar, flakes are going to fly everywhere, but this color is so easy to work with and so beautiful. Sticking on the easy to work with snow like colors, Triple D released a color called Diva Dust. It's on the pricier side, but she is well worth it. This is literally like snow. Like in the jar, it feels like it could be snow. But just look as it hits the light, how it shifts from like a pinky purple to a blue. I really love this color and it's truly beautiful, so easy to work with, and I even wore it recently. Sparkle & Co. has a couple colors that were limited edition for their holidays and Christmas Queen was one of them. It came out in 2019 and I love the colors they chose. So you have your green and then like some shifty kind of red. It's like a red pink, some opaly like colors in the background, and some fine glitter. Gingerbread Manny released in 2020 and I love this one. You got a rose gold base here and then you have red and white shards. It reminds me of like gingerbread but also like peppermint and all that stuff. I really love how these came together. This color is called Christmas Vacation and it's from Soul Dip and I really love all the different textures and I'm going to be honest, my swatch stick here does not do the color justice. It's even more beautiful in person. These are so fun. She included different elements. You have a Christmas tree, snowflake, different shards, snow-like background. I just love it all. Deck the Halls is a part of her new collection and it reminds me of all of the colors on a Christmas tree when you have all the colorful lights on a Christmas tree so I feel like she really nailed it with this color. She has so many more gorgeous Christmas colors. I really wish I could include them all but don't worry I'm going to be doing a review on that new collection very soon. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching that video. I know there was like a lot of dip powders on that list, a lot of favorites of mine, but man, companies are really nailing it this year. So thank you guys so much for watching. And if you have a Christmas or holiday favorite that is on your list that I didn't mention here in today's video, be sure to leave a comment below and let me know which one it is. I still got some time to shop, okay? So, all right, see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye.